But thank you for joining us today. Um, now, as we understand it, you're the author of the book On the Track of Water Secret. Um, can you tell us what got you interested in water in the first place? In the first place, I have been uh, the chief of the consumer production in Austrian DV. And they told me about the technology of Mr. Granda from Tirol. Mm -hmm. And I thought they are very stupid because uh, I couldn't imagine that you can give information into water or uh, to you can change water without technical equipment. And it has been two or three years and they told me again and again and as a consumer producer I said uh, if we do nothing wrong it's not a story for me. Then they say no it's not a story that they do something wrong. Uh, it's he can change the water and he can uh, optimize the water. I couldn't believe it, I couldn't believe it. It's, it's another world, it's yeah. completely another world. One day then I came to Tirol and uh, I made a meeting with him. He was a very nice old man, very close. We have the same pre name. His name is Hans, my name is Hans. Uh, and he showed me uh, a box with letters. I said, look at these letters. The people write me these letters. And as a journalist, I got very interested and say, uh, can I see these letters? And he gave me this and said, I want to control. I want to check. Is it true what they say? Are there crazy people that write you letters about a uh, better situation uh, of growing the flowers or for health, for everything. And I need three years and I checked one second, the third, and step by step I came closer uh, to this idea. It's now eight years, uh, it, it has been eight years ago I started this. And then I had the problem, I went to the scientists and asked them, can is it possible that they produce information into water? They say, no, 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 no. And then I went to the, to the people, they use it, and I was surprised. They are very common people, and they have sworn that it works. And so I tried to bring them together. The, the experience and the science. And uh, then I found some scientists, they say it's possible because we know such a, a little bit of the, uh, what water can do. It will be the greatest problem of the 21st century to get very good, clear, healthful water. Whenever water, you have enough, there's no discussion. It's self-evident. It's absolutely self-evident. But we are in a situation, some countries more, some countries less, we are, we are in a situation that we have problems more and more about water. And so here it comes together, to come together to, to save water from the quality and from the quanti quantity and in the mind, it must happen in the mind because we waste water any time. Big companies make the very, very big business with water. So it's also a question of democracy, of independence. So we have to develop uh, water systems all over Europe, mm -hmm. also all over the world, that everybody has the right to get good, clear, healthful water. We need to change in our mind. That's the most important thing, that we say water is a holy thing, exactly a holy thing. And this holy thing we have to save. We have to save in, in the administration. I think it's also a dangerous way to give the very big uh, companies the right to sell the water. I am absolutely sure in the meantime, because I told you I have more than a thousand examples. And at the beginning, 
The most experiences has been uh, has been on private uh, experiences from from people, yeah. but now we have big companies who use it for their systems, and they are they count the money and they test the water several times a day and their experience are scientifically relevant. Yeah. You save the money because they need no uh, bioseeds, uh, pesticides uh, and other chemical products to save the water, to stabilize the water mm -hmm. uh, and they don't destroy the water with this technology and uh, now we have uh, as you know, uh, downhill ski runners, they make the, uh, the, the skiers with this water. They make the actual the snow? Or? No, not the snow. This the, the, the plastics. Uh, oh, for the material for the, the skis? The materials for the skis. In, in Austria, it's a, a big company uh, to produce for the world championship the skiers. Right. And they use it. And there are several uh, other uh, car companies, they use it and they have, uh, they can show you exactly their uh, results. One year ago, a meeting, a European meeting with uh, medicians and they changed their experiences and I think we have in Germany 40 or 50 uh, doctors, uh, medicians, they are working with this water. You have to be very, very carefully to produce the results because the people, they are sick, they are ill, they have in their mind their maybe their last hope for helping and you have to be uh, very, very carefully. But otherwise, we have to go this way too to make experience how water can help for your health but uh, the results you have say very very loud less they find that um, one or one and a half percent uh, less uh, diesel uh, Consumed by the, by yes, the locomotives. By the locomotives. Okay. <laughs> and and for China, that's a large amount of diesel. <laughs> yeah. You can uh, think it's the, uh, as much as diesel as, as an example in Austria sure. you use all over the year. I understand the skeptics because I have been very, very skeptic. I, I said it's uh, out of mind, uh, it's absurd. Especially in Austria, it's easier because we are very rich in quality, high quality of water. So uh, I think it's also a very dangerous way in the European Union that this they want to distribute the water. They say we have to bring it from Central Europe to Spain. Right. We have to find a way to protect the water in Spain. We have mm. to find a way to protect, uh, to, to save the water in England. Mm and uh, not to transport it because it's the, the wrong mind in your head if you say uh, you can uh, solve the problems uh, by transportation water from one place to the other. Mm. It would be so clever like you say you make a system you bring the blood from the head and the legs. I think it's the wrong, uh, the wrong way uh, to give it to the private companies, but uh, it's a way it's very hard to stop. Mr. Kronberger, thank you very much. You're welcome. Appreciate your time. Thank you.